you're going to be hearing actually I stuck my recorder outside the door and this is what I heard and this is a long black older model I guess you call them station wagon SUV I don't know what the hell they call them uh, but listen to this <laughs> Hickory Avenue going down uh, going east on 15th Street you can probably arrest them at 15th Street right now just about busted the eardrums in my my ears I could hear him all the way down half a mile down the road it was black in color an older model black SUV I want him arrested and I want him thrown in jail once vehicle take away under 932 contraband I want him arrested under 3015 of Florida statutes do do we citizens have a right to live in peace anymore where are you at right now what why I, I just gave you I just gave you which the direction of where you can arrest this punk are you concerned about that do you care about the Pardon me? Did you get a tag number? Oh, we, uh, let me ask you something. When jewelry stores get robbed, they don't need a tag on that. When banks get robbed, they don't need a tag on that. So, no, you know, I, you know, I have to yell at me, sir. I'm very, I'm very frustrated, Zach. I want him arrested. I want him thrown in jail. It's night right now. Uh, I'm in my home. How am I supposed to get a tag? And even in the state of Florida, they don't even have a front tag required on a, a vehicle in the state of Florida. All right, well, we'll keep an eye out for them. I got your information. Let, well, let me ask you something, Zach. Would you give me your home phone number so I can call you every time these punks come down the road and wake you up all the hours of the night? Good night, sir. Good night. We'll get out with this. Thank you. The Bay County Sheriff's Office. If you have an emergency, I need a deputy. Yes, is this the Bay County Sheriff's Department? Yes, sir, it is. Who am I speaking to, please? Badge number 367. Okay, operator uh, 367. I'm trying to report. Just went down the road on 15th Street. I just reported to the Panama City Police Department. When I reported him a couple minutes ago, he was at Lisby Street and, and, and 15th, 15th Street. Lisby Avenue and 15th Street. Large, long, black SUV. You could hear him half a mile away. I want him arrested under 3015 of Florida statutes, and I want his vehicle taken away under 932 contraband. Okay, sir. Okay, so you just returned down that street? Um, all I can tell you is, is I'm in my home. I'm trying to give you an estimate where he might be, and I do believe he's a drug dealer, and I can't figure out why it is. The Panama City cops can't do anything about these punks that violate our rights to live in peace. Have citizens lost the rights to live in peace in their home now? No, sir. You said this was about a couple minutes ago. Pardon me? You said it was a couple minutes ago? Yeah. I mean, I'm trying to figure this out. This punk goes up and down the road, goes down there, he's a drug dealer. I know he's a drug dealer. It goes down there on the beach down there and sells his drugs. Because I see him going up and down the road. But the Panama City idiot clowns are too busy terrorizing homeless people. Them punks can't do anything about them. Because I do believe that they're drug boys for the Panama City cops. I can't believe this. I'm trying to live, dude, I'm trying to live in my home in peace. I'm trying to keep our ambulance and fire department people, you know, safe. First responders, January recently, a month ago, they had this propaganda thing called move over law, 
What is the chances of an ambulance or fire department person being heard by one of these punks with one of their great big loud systems in their cars? Right. What is the chances? I, I mean, I can't believe it. Why don't you set up a sting and arrest the cops that, that don't do anything about it? Arrest the Panama City cops. Seems to me like, I guess we're just waiting for an ambulance or fire department person, fire department person to die in a horrible crash, right? We're waiting to that, but we won't try to prevent it, right? I'm just trying to figure this out, man. Because I'd like to ask you, would you give me your home phone number so I can call you every time these punks come down the road and I can wake you up all the hours of the night? Well, I'll tell you what, I guess you'll be the first person that's ever done it. I want him arrested and I want him thrown in jail. I want his be I want him also arrested under 876 in the Florida sta Florida statute, which is a terrorism statute. All you gotta do, uh, sir, just set a down a, a deputy down there with a video camera. Every time one of these boom cars go by, arrest them. Then they can have the video camera there, uh, you know, and then they can see the type of speakers that they got in their vehicle because you don't need a warrant under 3015 of Florida statutes to arrest them. And the Bay County Sheriff's Department could take and put up signs everywhere in Bay County. We hear a boom car, we'll take it away and we'll put you in jail for life. Yes, Zach, um, I, I am trying to report a super loud car stereo. When I when I talk to you around Elizabeth B and 15th Street, I don't know where that drug dealer is now or what, what the hell is going on, but I was trying to enjoy my home February 22nd. Do you have any, have any new information for us? Because we've already got that information out. It seems to me like I can't figure it out, man. You can hear him like half a mile away. All right. Well, we've, we've got that information out. Do you have anything new for us? Uh, well, I'd like to know why is it, why it is the cops will terrorize broken down homeless people. They'll go through the bushes. They're beaten with the flashlights to try to find homeless people. But these punks can terrorize innocent people. Let, let me ask you something. Do we got to wait for a horrible crash because the boom car punk cannot hear an ambulance or fire department person, I hear the ambulance and fire department people racing up and down the road. If you don't have any uh, Do we, new information for me, I'm going to have to disconnect, okay? I, wa I want him arrested. You might even find you might even find a bunch of drugs in there. You might find guns, too, <laughs> unless he happens to be a runner for the Panama City Cops for drugs and guns. I'm trying to prevent. These emergency vehicles, they go at very high rates of speed to try, try to save people's lives. And these boom car punks put them in severe danger. Yep. I hear these vehicles going up and down the road all night long and I'm trying to protect them from these boom car punk motherfuckers. As of December 23rd, 20, 2016, 748, there was a super loud car stereo. It was, it had rims on it. It looked like to me it might have been um, a white car that would just came down the road going from uh, from east going to west right now. He's probably down there by the Hathaway Bridge. I'd like to have him arrested on one's vehicle take away under the 932 contraband. I want him arrested under 3015 of Florida statutes. All right, so I can send an officer out that direction. I don't understand it. I was in my home 
You know? Vicky, would you give me your home phone number so I can call you every time these punks come by? Uh, no, sir, but I'll put an officer out there. I'm trying to figure this out. Heck, whip. I'm trying to protect our ambulance and fire department people. Vicky, what is the chances of an ambulance or fire department person being hurt by one of these punks that's got a system that you can hear half a mile down the road? I'm not sure, sir, but I'll be glad to send you an officer. Notice how they to play me? dumb. To find the car. All you gotta do is intersect them before he gets over the Hathaway Bridge or get All the... Right. Get the Bay County so Sheriff's me, Department to arrest him under... Let me get... Some low-life motherfucker trains these... The cops? Everybody is fucking trained. Everybody in government use the same motherfucking excuses, words. They must be grilled. Anybody ask you a question? Don't admit to anything. They must have a fucking sign up that says, Don't admit to anything. They probably have a, a, a fucking board up there, uh, bulletin board, common ways to frustrate people, uh, over talk them, uh, never admit to anything, uh, try, try your damnedest to get them as pissed off as possible so that you can have an innocent person uh, entrapped, that's Florida Statute 777-201 of the Florida Statutes. And, um, and because this person here, we consider him a pain in the ass. And let's forget about the fact that uh, uh, we swore an oath under 876 of Florida statutes to, uh, as a public servant oath. But let's forget about that. That's just a convenient motherfucking lie. So anyway, uh, this is what I believe is going on. Let me get up the phone so I can get an officer out that way, okay? Nikki, all I'm trying to do... Is I am pleading, I am begging for the lives of our ambulance and fire department people that I see racing up and down the road. I'm trying to prevent a horrible crash. And Vicki, I know that you're more aware of the speeds that they have to go. You're more of how many times that you've got a call. I only know one road, 15th Street, that's all. All right, so I'll send an officer out that way. I'm going to disconnect this call, okay? All right. So anyway, um, I've had them, uh, one even one of them said to me, uh, well, are you going to deny the rights of a deaf person to be able to go down the street? And see, they they want you to cuss them out. They want you to threaten them. But you see, the thing is, is I don't rely on me. I rely on, on my maker to allow me to put the right words in my mouth so they don't trap me. Because I don't know anybody who they've tried to trap more than me.